function of, the performance of, the manifestation of, the works. The whole blinking cosmos, with all its galaxies, and forever and ever and ever, whatever it is beyond that. everyday consciousness that we have leaves out more than it takes in. And because of this, it leaves out things that are terribly important. It leaves out things that would, if we did know them, allay our anxieties and fears and horrors, we would have a deep interior peace. Now, the question that is absolutely basic for all human beings is, what have you left out?
is not a big rock infested with living organisms any more than your skeleton is bones infested with cells. The earth is geological, yes, but this geological entity grows people. And so the existence of people is symptomatic of the kind of universe we live in.
But we have this hostility to the external world because of the superstition, the myth, the absolutely unfounded theory that you yourself exist only inside your skin. Now I want to propose another idea altogether. coming on as whoever you are. See, when I meet you, I see not just what you define yourself as, Mr. So-and-so, Miss So-and-so, Mrs. So-and-so. I see every one of you as the primordial energy of the universe coming on at me in this particular way. I know I'm that too.
God himself puts his arms around you and says, welcome home.
do the sounds come from, according to your ears? You hear them coming out of silence. The sounds come, and then they fade away, like echoes. The sounds don't come from the past. They come out of now. Trail off, trail off.
according to your ears. You hear them coming out of silence. Sounds 